The White House is preparing to unveil its plan today to lower gas prices, and that includes releasing another 15 million barrels of oil from the nation's stockpile. So President Joe Biden is expected to announce that along with a series of steps aimed at bringing Americans some relief at the pump. ABC's Justin Finch is following this story and has the details. Though Americans are now paying less on average to fill up their gas tanks, today the White House is expected to roll out its plan to bring even more relief to U.S. households. Should the president not do everything that he can to lower prices? Uh, should he not continue to keep his prime promise to give American people a little bit of breathing room? President Biden is expected to authorize releasing 15 million oil barrels from the U.S.'s Strategic Petroleum Reserve. The final dispersal of the 180 million barrels the president pledged in March from the nation's stockpile. But critics say the 15 million barrels isn't enough, considering the U.S. consumes about 20 million barrels per day. That last round of reserve oil due for release in December after the November midterm elections. I think the key story there is that is this administration uh, doing as, as much as we can uh, to help uh, increase the energy supply? And I think the answer is well, unequivocally yes. They should be talking about how things, how much things cost at the supermarket, at the gas pump, how people feel unsafe on the streets. Republicans fine-tuning their midterm messaging around inflation and the economy, with early voting underway in some states. That as gas prices have dropped five cents in the last week, but the national average for a gallon of gas is now 20 cents higher than one month ago. The president is also expected to go after oil companies which have seen record profits this year. The White House plan also comes weeks after OPEC Plus announced it's cutting oil production by 2 million barrels per day starting in November. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington. All right, let's check out what gas prices are looking like today here at home. It'll cost you about three fifty six a gallon. That's here in Hampton Roads and compare that to just one week ago. It was three fifty four, so not too drastic of a change. But get this a month ago, it was three thirty one to fill up. That's a twenty five cent difference in just one month. Triple A says it can't predict if the prices will continue to rise or not.